<clears throat> in this video I'm going to show you how to link the drop down list control to the grid view control um, I'm going to show you in the beginning how each of these controls is independent of each other so they don't interact with each other at all so to make them link together let's get started to do this in a Visual Studio you so in the current page I have two control that you saw on the browser to make them link together you want to configure the SQL data source 2 control which can which feeds data to the grid view control you want to configure the data source you want to click next on this screen when you get to the select statement screen you want to click on the where clause, where button and this is where you define the where clause you want the parameter to be the category ID and equal of operators fine and then you want the source to be from a control and you want to select the drop down list control you want to add that condition click OK click next click finish and now let's preview our results in the browser again As you can see, the category in the drop down list controls the grid view control now. So it's pretty simple and it's less than two minutes.